Heights senior reporter Eileen Buckley is giving a voice to Erie County's election commissioners along with voters as we learn who's eligible to vote in this race between Tim Kennedy and Gary Dixon. It is a vast district. It's, it's big. This is a very important race. If you're a registered voter in the 26th Congressional District, this is what your special election ballot will look like in Erie County, with Democrat Tim Kennedy facing off against Republican Gary Dixon. Thousands of ballots are being processed at the Erie County Board of Elections. Early voting starts this weekend. We've had to put special coding on to make sure that we get it correct for the right election uh, for the absentee ballots. Erie County election commissioners from both sides of the aisle tell me it's incredibly easy for enrolled voters to cast ballots. All 38 polling sites will be open across the county for early voting. If you go within Erie County and vote early, you'll get the ballot that you uh, that is in your district. So even if you live in Buffalo and you go out to Sardinia and vote there, you're going to get the ballot that you you're required to get out in Sardinia. If you take a look at this 26 congressional map, you can see how far reaching this district is. It goes into Niagara Falls up to Lewiston, um, so it's a big district that spans two different counties. It's about half of uh, Erie County, so there are over 300,000 eligible voters. Party affiliation does not matter in this race. I'm hoping people get out there and vote. The most important thing is for people to go vote. I spoke to district voters Darlene Ott and Paul Owens at the Cheektowaga Senior Center. I'm hoping we get somebody in Congress that will get along with all the other people that are in the House of Representatives that are not getting along and maybe get some things done in Congress. Despite the difficult political climate, these voters tell me the only way to make change is to cast your ballots. When I go in there and vote, I decide then what, whom I'm going to vote for. And I never, ever tell anyone who I'm voting for, ever. I think it's going to be a good race. It might be a very close race, I am thinking, right now. Now, if you are an eligible voter, that voting starts April 20th and runs through the 28th. No voting on the 29th, but then the special election will be held April 30th. At the Erie County Board of Elections, Eileen Buckley, 7 News.